Hi guys, today we're going to be going over watercolor basics. Um, the watercolors that we have for this class are a basic pan with eight colors. <clears throat> watercolors come in like larger pans with a lot um, more colors, but if we have the basic primary, secondary, we can make most of our colors. Um, they also come in tubes that are like concentrated dye that you water down. So <clears throat> when we're working with our pan of watercolor, some important things you want to have are um, watercolor paper, which we've talked about is really heavy, so it doesn't warp. I like to have a scrap paper nearby just to test the opacity of my paint, make sure I have um, enough water, but not too much water. Uh, obviously, you're going to need a cup of water. Try to keep it clean. If your water gets dirty, then you need to refresh your water. And a paintbrush. Uh, <clears throat> I don't love the paintbrushes that come with watercolor sets. They're kind of like for little kids and they're very frayed and um, not the best quality. So I would use the, the brushes that you got in your class pack. Also, I find it handy to have um, a paint tray that has some wells in it so that I can mix up colors inside of here. Um, a lot of watercolor pads have that like built into their lid, but since ours is just like a big space, then our colors could like bleed into each other. So it's just nice to have one of these handy. Also, you will need to have a paper towel to clean your brush, clean the water off of your brush in between use. All right, so let's get started. 